coming from Spain, Mar Alarcon. I just met her briefly recently in Barcelona, one of my favorite cities, and she's a serial entrepreneur. Started with a social energy, and now it's all about social car. Sure. And there's a clicker for you. Thanks. <clears throat> so, well, good afternoon. Uh, thank you, Eco Summit, for inviting us. Well, uh, I would like to review a little bit where are we coming from. We are coming from, from an economic bonanza. We used to see lots of these kind of notes in Spain during the construction boom, and we're not seeing them anymore. So, and this leads us to an, ex an excessive consumption. We have been consuming, consuming in excess, and we are like buying, throwing out all stuff, and this leads us to a massive mis misallocation of assets. In our case, we will talk about cars. Um, Klaus gave us, gave us lots of interesting data on, on this aspect. But we have to say that cars sp spend 90% of the time in Europe, 90% of the time uh, either doing nothing. So, so we need a change, and we need to go through smart cities, a concept that we are hearing lately mm, a lot, so cities that are introducing technology to be more efficient in terms of time, energy, and quality of life. But we think that we also have to consider the co-city concept. This uh, a smart city could not be efficient without connecting all the agents that have historically acting separately. So in social care, what we, what we do is to is use technology to connect all these agent, agents and bring solutions to, solutions to the actual problems, problems like economic crisis, environmental crisis, and why not values crisis. And now with social care, we are giving him the opportunity to get an extra income. So uh, uh, renting the second most important asset in, their, in his family, that is the car. Uh, he, couldn't, he, he couldn't do that before. And so we can say that we are a social business. On the other side, we have Maria. She's lovely but she doesn't own a car because uh, she's aware about the cost that this suppose and also she's an eco-friendly minded person so she decided to rent Paco's car and with social car now we are give, we're giving her an alternative an alternative mobility uh, and why not a sustainable mobility solution because we are optimizing the cars we already have we are not putting more cars in the cities. We are not uh, using more space. We consider that we have enough and enough cars, and we, don't ha we have a lack of space. So let's use what we already have. And also, we are pushing other, car other kind of values. But what I like the most is the community value. We think that we are connecting these agents I was talking before. We are connecting people. We are reconnecting these people. We are. Uh, we are doing that the people is handling hands again. We started on July with uh, one million private investment from social energy. Uh, social en the so owners of social energy are the same entrepreneurial team as social car. And we started with six uh, people, full-time team. And what we achieved uh, since the month of July, we already have 500 cars, 3,000 drivers, and we have uh, 11 rental average per week. And we think that this is a quite, quite a success because uh, one of the barriers we find at first was cultural barriers. Everyone was telling us that in Spain we are very untrusty, we don't trust each other, and also we have a huge, a huge attachment to the car. And well, we think that this is not, not true anymore because people is really interesting, interested in this business and they are calling us every day and we are um, uh, acquiring cars day by day. Then, well, this is a little bit of data from the, the rentals. The rentals is two days average, but you can rent hour, hour per hours, per days, per weeks, and 90 euros cost average per, per rental, and we got a 50% commission of uh, the rentals. And then, uh, what's our scope? Uh, from the end of the year, well, uh, with this million private investment, uh, we would like to achieve uh, 2,000 cars, 50,000 drivers, and of course, going international to other countries, culturally, 
uh, near to Spain where there's no any peer-to-peer -peer -peer car sharing where that we think that is really good thing. Then, well, I don't know what happened, but uh, who we are, uh, as I said, the entrepreneurial team is the same, entrepreneurial, uh, same entrepreneurs that set up social energy in 2005 when we were living in China and there were a huge demand of photovoltaic. Uh, we have, um, this is a renewable energy company specialized in photovoltaic. We, ha we are based in Spain, we have branches in France and Italy. We have uh, 15 megawatts installed in Europe and we have a, a cumulative turnover of 60 million from 2006 to 2011. And well, we have lots of uh, sexy brands in our CVs, but this is not the important stuff. The important thing is that we are leading a very motivated, multidisciplinary and qualified team, and of course, really, really social-minded. So thank you for listening, and any questions will be welcome. <laughs>